A halberd is a European staff weapon consisting of a long wooden staff and a metal head. The head contains three parts, a spear point for thrusting, an axe blade for chopping, and a hooked beak that was originally for piercing armor. Initially, halberds were used for battle against armored opponents and opponents mounted on horseback. Some of the earliest examples of medieval halberds come from the Swiss peasantry in the 1200s. However, the mid-1500s seemed to mark a turning point for the halberd. Guns were becoming the most effective tools for warfare, and halberds lost their competitive advantage in most battle situations. Consequently, halberds started to be valued for their ability to be elaborately decorated. Some of the most highly decorated halberds belong to the bodyguard units of important noble rulers such as popes, princes, and kings. Not only could bodyguards' halberds be used effectively for crowd control, but they also had a strong visual impact. The big surfaces of the blades could carry messages communicating the identity of their bearers. On this blade, we see the royal coat of arms of its commissioner, Archduke Ernst of Austria, and the initials EE -E that stand for Erzherzog Ernst. Additionally, we see the date 1593, the year that Ernst became the regent of the Netherlands. It is likely that this halberd was commissioned to commemorate his rule there. Similarly, a family coat of arms is present on the halberd for the guard of Prince Karl I of Liechtenstein. This coat of arms refers to the Liechtenstein family, who had become princes only a few years before this halberd was made. The curve of the axe blade here hampers its functionality as a chopping weapon. Consequently, we start to see the decorative properties of halberds overtake practical ones, transforming this weapon from a tool of war to a ceremonial object. Compare an Italian halberd from the 1540s to the halberd of King Carlos IV of Spain from 1789. The 1540s halberd features a strong, thick, and straight axe blade that would have been good for landing a chopping blow. The beak also would have been successful at piercing armor. These qualities reveal its battle-ready function. By contrast, the King Carlos halberd is small, and it features a curved and thin axe blade, which would have generated a weak blow. Its blunt hook would not have been able to pierce anything. Ironically, this date also marks the year that medieval systems of aristocratic rule came crashing down following the start of the French Revolution a series of events that paved the way for present-day democracy. Carlos himself lost his throne due to pressure from Napoleon. Poetically, the halberd seems to pass out of history with Carlos, as relics of the medieval period made way for rulers and weapons of modern times.